um, congratulations, champ. Champion. No, man, no, thank you. That was 697. We don't get to see that that often. <laughs> um, talk to me about that race and just the shape you're in, man. You're looking like a different athlete. You're looking hungry again, like you're falling back in love with the sport. Yeah, I, I definitely have. I know the past two years have been difficult. I've told everyone this. A lot of people didn't know, but my dad, you know, was going battling cancer, and then he finally passed away last year. So, so I'm sorry to hear that. Oh, thank you. I, I'm really private, so I'm not going to put my sorry. business out there. But, um, yeah, so I had... I went through a depression, it was tough to train, hard to, you know, kind of like get my mojo back. But, you know, after going through the grieving process, it's almost a year. March 24th is when he passed away. So um, I'm almost a year in, so I feel better. I can speak about him. Can I tell him right? Yes, I can. So now, you know, I just went into this race and, you know, prayed to him and prayed to God. And he said, was that he's carrying me through. Was that bit behind the celebration at the end? Because yes. that was a big outpouring yes. of emotion. Yes, it was. It was. It was like finally. I just I was so happy I'm world champion and just when I saw the time I just couldn't believe it so happy I mean listen I, I've, I'm on social networking a lot and I've seen the relationship with yourself and Carmelita Jetta um, flourishing talk to me about her input and how that's influenced you know a lot of where you are right now oh, of course well Carmelita is my mentor you know my coach is Alan Powell and I train in Houston Texas but she has been unbelievable such a beautiful soul and has really you know her her aunt died from cancer as well so we definitely have that bond yes yeah, so you know she's helped me deal with you know all of these emotions and everything in a different way and especially from a woman's standpoint as well and my coach has been you know he's been my rock like my best friend we talk every single day we probably talk 10 times a day which is crazy but you know it's just such a beautiful relationship so to just have people that you know truly genuinely love you like that is is amazing especially through the dark times yes talk to me about how this sets you up for your outdoor season um i'm excited i'm just i'm sure i'll go back into um <sighs> Fall training, again, not fall training, but background training, heavy training, which I'm not looking forward to. Oh, man, it's so painful. But, um, yeah, so that's it. And Enjoy the moment. You're going to take a week or so off there, right? I don't know what my coach is going to do. We'll see. But I think so. <laughs> you deserve it. Well done. Thank you. Thank you so much.